Dave, if you go back on this day in history, 53 years, one of the great sporting events in our country's history took place right here a couple blocks away. Madison Square Garden, the fight of the century. Ooh. It was Joe Frazier against Muhammad Ali. Both guys essentially laid claim to the heavyweight title. Ali had his strip because of his protest of the Vietnam War. 300 million people wow. watched this fight around the globe. Both guys were guaranteed $2.5 million. That's 53 years ago. That's the money that this fight generated. Joe Frazier won this fight, 15-round decision. Ali then beat him the next two times, mm -hmm. including the thriller in Manila. But this was the biggest sporting event in our it's, country's history, really. Is it, and it happened 53 years what ago. What the Super Bowl is now, these big heavyweight fights used to be then. It was, it was The world stops for yeah, this fight. This one especially because it was Ali coming back from uh, being stripped of his right to box and all the Vietnam War protests mm -hmm. and all that. But think about that. 125 million people watched the Super Bowl this past year, right? Ballpark, okay? Mm -hmm. 300 wow. million people watched this fight at Madison was Square Garden. <laughs> and to think, say again? Was Taylor Swift there? Good question. <laughs> and to think that that's where boxing was 53 years ago. And today, the biggest news in boxing is not Joshua versus Nagano, which happens this weekend. It is the fact that a 57-year-old Mike Tyson is now fighting uh, Jake Paul in a boxing match at Dallas Cowboys Stadium in July. That's where boxing is right now. That that, whether you like it or not, it will be I the most it. viewed Can boxing match happen? of yeah. the year. Can, Can we it? not do this? Yeah, I'm going to watch it. This is <laughs> You are going to watch it? I'm going to watch no it. No way. Yeah, watch Mike, it too. Mike this, Tyson wins this fight in 45 seconds. But this uh, is why you have to question your friends, right? Because real yeah. friends say Mike don't do this. I don't, don't want to see this, Grandpa Mike. get knocked out. Yeah, don't but just think fight. about that. You went from a boxing match, right? 300 million people watched it before we even had the technology that you could reach that many people, yeah. okay? And Tyson at 57 against Jake Paul, who I give a lot of credit to. He's made himself into a box office smash this is as a fighter, brilliant at business and all that, is the most anticipated fight of the year. That's pathetic. This is and that's a sad state of affairs yeah. for the world of boxing because, you know, there are a handful of good boxers out there. Terrence Crawford comes immediately to mind mm -hmm. as the best pound-for-pound -pound boxer alive today. And there ain't nobody for him to fight. So that'll happen in July.